Hey guys, Kevin here to do a quick review of the Numeth Tow Hill Lighter, a nice small EDC lighter for your everyday carry. So let's take a look at it. Alright guys, so I've got the Tow Hill out of the packaging. I just wanted to show you the contents of the package. First off, let's talk about the packaging. Um, it's a nice sturdy plastic packaging. It's actually pretty cool. It's reusable, so you can use it to put you know, spare parts or keep the O-rings or whatever you deem necessary to put in it. It's got a nice slide closure on it. So I really like that about the product. It, you know, reusable packaging was really neat. So next it comes in, get this out of the way here, uh, is uh, an instruction manual. You got, you know, basic troubleshooting tips, uh, how to fill the lighter and uh, things like that. And so it's always worth a good read. Um, then you also have a couple spare O-rings. The O-rings are very important. It, inside the cap of the lighter uh, is where it keeps it watertight. So spare O-rings. All right, guys, now that we have it out of the packaging, let's take a better look at it. Let's get some specs on it. So the lighter itself is 2.2 inches long, weighs one point. Four ounces is made out of an uh, aluminum alloy. It's got a uh, type 3 anodizing finish which not, keeps it nice and shiny and a little scratch resistant for a long time. So now that you have the specs on the lighter, let's talk about why I purchased this lighter um, and one of my favorite things about this lighter. I thought the best way to illustrate that was to show you my previous P lighter and kind of talk about the things that I didn't like on it. So I'm going to bring that out real quick. Here it is. This is a, a true utility P lighter. Um, you know, the the reason I picked up P lighters, or the reason I wanted a P lighter, is was I wanted something to carry on my keychain, uh, so I didn't have to carry a lighter in my pocket. So I wanted it to be small, compact, which the true utility lighter did do for me. A couple places where this lighter failed was the flat, the round bottom couldn't stand the lighter up, so it couldn't do candle mode, which is not a huge deal, but it kind of bothered me. The next thing was this right here. As you can see, as I took it out, it would actually slide out. There's nothing holding the lighter in its inside the t the capsule couldn't stand that anytime I went to light a stove or a fire it would slide out right in there so let's get rid of that and that's why we picked up the tow hill lighter right off the bat it's better machining it's CNC machined so it's really really nice another thing is if you see these little flat panels on the side which made it really nice to open when you wanted to screw and unscrew the cap so if you had your hands wet or it was raining you could you could really get in there and open it up which is really nice um, the next thing was if you check out here versus say like the, the true utility this is kind of a loose little top where the uh, attachment to your keychain is so they've been known to break this is actually CNC'd into the cap so it won't pop off really really great feature because you know when you carry things on your keychain they bounce around um, so it won't come off really nice flat bottom you know you can take that the lighter out candle mode beautiful um, next thing the most important thing to me um, it won't fall out. Beautiful. So you can actually, you know, light a stove, you can, you know, light a fire without having to worry about the mechanism falling out. And the reason being is if you take this mechanism, I'm not sure if you can see that. There's a little inside the uh, capsule here, there's a little lip there that actually, if you can, I don't know if you can hear it, there you go, locks it into place, um, making it, it won't come out. Which also helps um, with keeping the, the airtight seal for uh, the fluid. So you, it's got a a washer around the lip here which helps keep it watertight and also keeping it tight so the fluid won't leak out you fill it up I've had this thing on my keychain a uh, couple months and still on the first filling up of lighter fluid runs off pretty much you know standard lighter fluid uh, everything else is pretty much standard so you have standard uh, refillable um, flint and the wicking just like a zippo ah uh, perfect Thanks for watching guys and if you enjoyed it, please subscribe or you can follow us on Instagram, Facebook or Twitter. To learn more, check us out at GearJunkiesReview.com.